Yo, dudes! Welcome to One Euro Dinners. Uh, so I went to Super Value earlier. I spent four euro twenty-four, um, and I've got enough food for six meals. We're going to cook a simple lentil sambar. It's just to show that healthy food can be quick, easy, tasty, and cheap. We're going to make this with no oil. So we've got our pan super hot. We've diced. One red onion? One red onion, two cloves of garlic. In they go, okay. So this is no oil cooking. In it goes, wait, the pan's super hot. Get that sizzle. So yeah, when you're cooking it in oil, the benefits are it's lower in calories. So it's, uh, it's good for people that are conscious of calories and want to lose weight, which is a lot of people anyway. And it really doesn't, doesn't kind of uh, detract from the flavor in any sense. But first thing to start with is pan needs to be really, really hot. So I'm gonna chop some root vegetables. I have one carrot and one parsnip. These are gonna bring a sweetness and a lovely rooty kind of earthy note to it. I'm gonna chop them finely so they cook quicker. So I fried in the onion and garlic for probably two minutes. And you'll see they're starting to brown. Now we're gonna sweat our carrot and parsnip. In they go. And whatever root veg you can find or you're, you like. Yeah, you mightn't get parsnip where you are every part of the world. Grab a generous pinch of salt. We're dropping that in to break the cell wall down in the root vegetable and help it release its moisture. Dave's just moving it around. Now we're gonna put a lid on that. Turn it down turn to it. medium heat and we're gonna leave it sweat for probably four minutes, I'd say. Okay, so step three in this, this is a very easy, easy recipe. So they've kind of browned nicely. It's a matter of simply adding everything else that we bought into the pan. So we've got one tin of baked beans. So baked beans are much cheaper. This is for the economically challenged. They were 29 cents for a tin of baked beans, whereas a tin of butter beans were gonna cost me a euro. So much cheaper to buy baked beans. And they are super low in sugar, like it's two grams of sugar. So. And it's essentially just cannellini or berlotti beans. So I've just chopped tomatoes, two cans of chopped tomatoes. I've got one 500 gram tin pack of red lentils. So these are split red lentils. They're really good for stretching your money and they're so nutritious and healthy and wholesome. So a full pack in it goes. I have a liter of veg stock. If you don't have veg stock, just put a liter of water in. I'd say we'll probably end up needing two liters by the time we're done. We've got two tablespoons of curry powder. This is gonna give the nice sense of kick. Just whatever kind of curry powder you have at home. Typically a medium one works perfect. And if you don't like it spicy, go with one. One would be perfect. I have two tablespoons of tamari or soy sauce. And these were obviously in, in my receipt of four, you were at 24. I didn't have, I presumed the people at home would have their tamari or the spices and the maple syrup. And essentially that'll bring it up to five euro. And it's really just a matter of leaving it boil now, dropping it down to simmer, and probably about 25, 30 minutes the lentils will be cooked and dinner is ready to go. Okay, so we've cooked that for about half an hour. I brought it to the boil and I reduced it. Lentils are soft, it's delicious. And when nettles become cooked like that, they hit it in an amazing, like, kind of mashed potato, baby food, belly hug, perfect texture. Um, if you could stretch your budget to a little bit of lemon or lime, it'd be nice, I think it'd go great. However, we have some sugar snaps. Chop them, try to chop them at an angle, you'll get to see the kind of, the little kind of um, beans in the middle and it just kind of makes it look more fresh. They're gonna add a crunch, vitality, and more nutrients to this dish. So just chop them as you go to serve. So all that we've done here is we kept kind of three quarters of sugar snaps and we're gonna keep them until the day that we're gonna serve each dish. Um, one thing I just thought of there was that if you wanna spread this dish even further is potatoes are really cheap and they'll really help bulk out this dinner as well. I just couldn't find any in the supermarket today. But okay, so I've simply got some containers which will work really well in the freezer and the fridge. And just to show you that we've got well over five portions here. Oh look, he's even gonna raise us. We get five and a half dinners. For four years, what was it, four years? Four years, 24. 24, wow. So we could have stretched it for a lemon, really. Um, but anyway, we're gonna taste it now just to show you that it really is very tasty and delicious. Ready? Wow. I've been tasting it all along, it's delicious. It really is, it's super tasty. Mm. It's smooth. It's delicious. Lentils are nearly a creamy It's texture. like a belly hug, it's super wholesome, it's delicious. You've probably got 500 to 650 grams of dinner there. Um, and literally each one costs less than yours, something like 80 cents, so really cheap, economical, super student friendly. And if you are obviously gonna make the six of them in bulk like that, freeze four of them and two of them you can keep for two days, so at least you're getting that freshness. It'll probably last three days in the fridge, so you could probably leave three in the fridge. Yep. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, let us know if you enjoy this, this economically one euro dinners, because definitely wanna do more of these, these are really fun. And once again, these are low in calories, they're oil free and they're fab. And if you're interested in oil free, we've got our happy heart course, which is our four week 
kind of oil-free plant-based challenge which we've had 10,000 people do from all over the world. And get some amazing results. Uh, thanks for watching, please subscribe and um, cheers! cheers.